This place was like a second home to me. And because of COVID, it's gone. Since the beginning of time, humans have formed communities so that they can feel a part of something. We've all heard the saying, you are the sum of the people around you. You're surrounded by people that are all working towards something that they fully believe in. And it just creates this incredible energy and just supportive atmosphere. What's going on? Cat looks like It's been over two years since I've moved to Denver. I can tell you personally that the biggest thing that kept me going, the biggest thing that motivated and inspired me, even on the days when I could just about break down and give up, was surrounding myself with like-minded people. Those of us who are building a thing that does not exist or that we can only see need a support system. <laughs> it's not easy. And if you can find yourself a group of individuals who are all doing the same thing, whether they are in the same place as you or years ahead, you are setting yourself up for success. When I moved to Denver, I had no work lined up, zero. And even worse, I had hardly any money. While I didn't have any potential clients when I moved to town, I did have a plan. Join the community and surround myself with like-minded people who share the same values and passions as me. There is this new co-working space called Wayfinder. Unlike most co-working spaces, this one had an edge. And it was built for those who had a sense of adventure. Wayfinder was kind of a little bit of everything. It was a co-op, a coffee shop, a tap room. We held networking events, panel discussions, pitch competitions for new startups, and threw massive parties and concerts. But it was so much more than that. We all had to hustle and grit, but we made room to play, which in my opinion is just as important as working hard. Wayfinder is the example of the perfect community, a group of individuals who all use their different sets of knowledge and skills to help build each other up. It's, it's an amazing thing and it's something that I've always wanted in a workspace for myself and not working at home by myself but coming to a place that's inspiring. Being a part of a community not only fueled me professionally, but personally. I had so much fun being around the people who had genuine passion for the things they filled their life with that it made me realize life isn't just about work. Community to me means surrounding myself with people that I can be myself around. It gave me a sense of purpose in my life. COVID ruined a lot of great things, and one of those things was the closing of a place that was a second home to me. So while the space is no longer a physical gathering place for us, the memories will always be there. Communities don't have to be a physical space. They can transcend anything that we can touch or see. There is no doubt in my mind that I have been shaped and molded by the people that have come into my life through Wayfinder. While it's extremely sad that Wayfinder is no longer a place for us to gather, I'm extremely grateful that it was ever a thing in the first place. I wish there was a way to know you're in the good old days before you've actually left them. Oh man, one last goodbye. If only words could do it justice, but they can't. So I'm just gonna leave it there. <laughs>